What up, family? Cause nothing to hit that like button, fam. We beginning to see an ongoing thing, fam, weekly, fam, of concerts, rap concerts being shot up. So this mean, fam, that you and I, you know, teenage kids, really, um, I, I mean, young adults, whatever the case might be, really be in real danger, fam, um, consuming um, these lyrics from these artists, fam, and consuming the environment that they in mixed with it. I'm beginning to see, fam, before we get into detail, that it's like a voodoo, the music. You say what you want to say. I, I, I know you're a hip-hop head and, and love artists, fam, but it's destroying the community. And me personally, I know for a big fact that it's doing it because I used to vibrate off drive-bys listening to Bowdy Bowdy, Master P uh, music, like straight up. So this situation, fam, is another one of them ones and it's concerning Boosie Badass concert, right? Now, off top, you know, I, I, when, when I seen this, you know, I'm like, you know, it's already enough going on with Boosie name tied to it, right? Which we know. I want to make it, you know, clear. We know that Boosie wasn't a shooter and he, he ain't responsible for what went on here in Tulsa, Oklahoma, right? Now, four people was hit, fam, at this event. Matter of fact, one in critical condition was hit in the head, right? She got four people in our Boosie concert. Now, one may say that, hey, man, that's just isolated. There'd be people getting into it and, you know, just trying to compress what's really real when it comes to the game. But I'm here to tell you, fam, it's very dangerous for your children or you to be going out to these hip-hop concerts rap concerts, dealing with certain people. It's really even dangerous, like a Travis uh, Scott. You feel what I'm saying? That you, we seen it, it wasn't concerning no shooting, but people got smothered and killed. Like, it's just a dangerous environment right now, fam, concerning hip-hop. Now, Boosie have not spoken out about this situation. He probably may not. Reasons why, because they don't give a damn, fam. They just going to get the bag and leave, like straight up. And the sad thing about it, I have heard Boosie even speak, you know, how his his music have destroyed the community, fam. He, you know, that set it off. We all know what it do. It, it set things off, fam. After so long of seeing your people set it off to your music, fam, what point do we, you know, have a stopping point in the heart and like, man, I just can't do this no more. Because there's plenty more ways to get money out the game. Hip-hop is not the only way. That's what made me think these dudes is one-sided and really ain't got a hustle like they say they do. They can't do nothing else. But uh, find another young artist to groom into some bullshit in this hip-hop game, fam. This is a sad situation. Nine times out of ten that these people were just innocent people, fam. <laughs> just in the way of other people's ignorance and bullets. No, I'm not blaming Boosie Badass for this situation at all. If you, you've been following the channel, I say all the time, I want Boosie to have a large amount of success, fam. Just in the right way, he got a calling on him. You feel me? But at the end of the day, fam, you got to pay attention to what's happening at these events that you're going to. I would feel a certain type of way if, you know... I go to, and then I heard somebody got killed at the concert. They came to see me. You feel me? This girl, and this multiple times that these things have happened. And these rappers just bag back on it and just let it happen, fam. And you know this part. You don't see no country music, rock star, any other Jamaican. People ain't going to the uh, the concerts to kill up people, man. You feel what I'm saying? Oh, it's only in hip hop. So they go to show you it's direct. That hip-hop music is what destroying the community. Nothing else, fam. And I'm speaking from experience. You got young dudes right now that's real gangsters. I ain't talking about you hood dudes. I'm talking about the street dudes. 
that's real gangsters. And when they listen to that music, they really consume that music, fam. Like, they really feel that, that music because they really live in that type of life in the streets, fam. It's a vibration to them. It's a cheerlead to their uh, football game. But I will keep y'all updated on situations like this, fam. But make sure you hit that like button and make sure you hit that subscribe button. I'm out.